Welcome to Pre-Math. In this video, we have got this big triangle ABC such that these points D and E are the midpoints for these side lengths so AC and BC respectively. And moreover, this uh, line segment is represented by this 5x plus 2, this one by 2y minus 8, this one by 2y minus 6, and finally this one by x plus 26 and now we are going to find the value of x and y please don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe let's go ahead and get started with the solution and here's our very first step we know that this point e is the midpoint of this line bc that means this line segment ce equals to this line segment EB. Therefore, I am going to equate these two expressions. I can write down 5x plus 2 equals to 2y minus 8. Let me go ahead and move this 2y on the left hand side and at the very same time I'm going to move this 2 on the right hand side. So we are going to get 5x minus 2y equals to negative 8 and this positive 2 is going to become negative 2. Let me go ahead and call this our equation number 1. Now let's recall this mid segment theorem. According to this theorem the segment joining the midpoints of two sides of a triangle is this line segment DE which is parallel to this third side AB and this side is a half the length of this one. In other words this line segment AB equals to 2 times the line segment DE and we know that AB is x plus 26 and DE is 2y minus 6 so therefore we can write x plus 26 equals to 2 times 2y minus 6. Let's go ahead and distribute this 2. So we are going to get x plus 26 equals to 4y minus 12. Let me go ahead and move this 4y on the left hand side and at the very same time I'm going to move this 26 on the right hand side. So therefore we are going to get x minus 4y equals to negative 12 and this 26 is going to become negative 26. Let me go ahead and call this our equation number 2. And here's our next step. We got this system of two equations. The first one is our equation 1 and the second one is our equation 2. And now we are going to solve this system by using the elimination method. Therefore, let's go ahead and multiply this first equation by negative 2 on both sides. So therefore, our equation is going to become negative 10x plus 4y equal to positive 20 on the right hand side and we are going to leave this second equation same and now let's go ahead and add these two equations we can see this positive 4y and negative 4y they are gone so on the left hand side we got simply negative 9x equal to negative 18. Let's divide both sides by negative 9. This is gone. So therefore our x value turns out to be positive 2. Now we are going to plug it in this x equal to 2 value in this equation 2. And here's our equation 2. Let's go ahead and replace x value by this 2. So we got 2 minus 4y equal to negative 38. Now let's go ahead and subtract 2 from both sides. This is gone. So our negative 4y on the left hand side equal to negative 40 on the right hand side. And now let's divide by negative 4 on both sides. They are gone. 
so therefore our y value turns out to be positive 10 so thus our solution turns out to be x equal to 2 and y equals to 10 thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos bye